post, and here is the one blue over Cody's by Overcomer. Owned by Peggy Carter, Sheila Hummel, Gerald Moore, and Robert Reed of Ohio. Driven and trained by Steve Carter, has won eight of 20 in second and five other races. Two minute mark on the half mile track up at our friends at Northfield. Number one blue overcoat for Steve Carter. Two hand over the Brad Fred, owned by the Michael Wise Estate of Lebanon. Chip Noble of Xenia. Hand over to Brad Fred, now being conditioned by Randy Roth and will be driven by Chip Noble. Having a career year of $122,000 in earnings. Eight of 18, very consistent three year old hand over to Brad Fred. Three quick Kirk by striking Sabra. Owned by Barbara Hughes, Helen Swank, and Barbara Hill of Ohio. Trained by Michael Hughes. Driven tonight by Don Feaster. Another consistent performer. Winner here at Scioto Downs in 159 and 4. Has five victories to his credit over the last two years of racing. Here's the four looking for speed. Three year old Bay Gelding by Speed and Action. Owned in Akron by Jimmy Tipton. Reigned and trained by Tom Davis. Only one blemish on his superior record so far this year. That was taken in his last race at Raceway Park where he made the misstep. Seven for 11 this year. Loves the oval here. Lifetime best 158. Number five is Ultimate Message by Carry the Message. Owned by J.C. Ratliff of Marion. Reigned and trained by Jim Pantoliano. 16 for 27. Ultimate message. Loves the big oval. He was second here to hand over to Brad Fred. Number five, ultimate message. Six, Makachi by Hay Gray Day. Owned in Marion, Indiana by Marilyn Sicanesi. Conditioner is Tony Price. The driver is David Miller. Winner of eight of 31. Winner of over $100,000. Six, Makachi has faced some top three-year-olds and will get tested tonight. Seven is Terminator P by striking Sabra. Winner of six out of 30. Very consistent performer goes tonight for Dave Hawk, who bids for his third victory in the Sire Stakes competition. Number eight is last year's two-year-old champion, Supreme Begonia, when he went undefeated. Still having a solid campaign this year for Marion Haynes of Blissfield, Michigan. Driven and trained by Cheryl Haynes. Winner of 12 of 16 and $120,000. Lifetime best, 156 and 2, 8, Supreme Begonia, 7 minutes till Pope. Field 4, race 9 is in behind, starter Andy Albert. Blue overcoat, hand over to Brad Fred. Quick Kirk, looking for speed. Ultimate message, Makachi, Terminator P. And last year's 2-year-old champion when he went undefeated, Supreme Begonia. They're at the gate and moving through the paddock turn. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and trotting. Supreme Begonia a little bit tardy. Looking for speed. An ultimate message are out for the lead. Here comes Makachi to settle in there third. They're down the back stretch. Hand over to Brad Fred and it gets away in fourth. Followed by Terminator P. Quick Kirk is off stride. Blue Overcoat is next and Supreme Begonia is the trailer. As they move into the quarter mile pole, Ultimate Message has gone on by looking for speed. Opening up here in a quick 27 and 3 fifths. Racing past the stands here, looking for speed. Back on the attack. Ultimate Message lets him go. He had to after being stung in that eye opening quarter. Followed by Makachi, hand over to Brad Fred is first up. After that, it's Terminator P, blue overcoat. Supreme Begonia begins to roll, and at the end, and not out of it, Quick Kirk. They're at the half mile pole. Looking for speed for Tom Davis, leads the way. Ultimate message and hand over to Brad Fred, our joint second and third. Makachi comes to the outside in 58. Straight enough for their long journey down the back stretch. Looking for speed. Looks for the big win tonight. Looking for speed, hand over to Brad Fred is up on the outside. Ultimate message fighting back along the pylons. Here comes Makachi rolling up on the outside. Blue overcoat, Terminator P, Supreme Begonia and Quick Kirk 
We're down to seven by three quarters at 127 and three. Moving around the far turn. Nearest the rail looking for speed. Hand over to Brad Fred. McEachie is up on the outside. Toward the rail, ultimate message as the field straightens away. Looking for speed. Hand over to Brad Fred. McEachie is up on the far outside. They're trying to get one home for Mike Wise. Hand over to Brad Fred. Looking for speed. Hand over to Brad Fred. Gets there at 157 and two. to Brad Fred, three-year-old Bay Colt by Overcomer, on with a former champion here and winner of the Triple Crown in Ohio, Ama Mama by Armbro Solar, owned by the late Mike Wise, who passed away last month, driver Chip Noble of Lebanon and Xenia, now conditioned by Randy Roth and hard driven by Chip Noble, to cover the mile in 157 and two, take a lifetime best and go over $170,000 this year in earnings. Representing Scioto Downs as the president of Scioto Downs, vice president and general manager of Mid-America Racing, Mr. Bob Steele, along with Paul Estock, assistant to Mr. Stanley Bergstein at Harness Tracks of America. Result is now official, the 2-4 exact returning $14.20 and the try, $52.80 and the windows are now up and on tonight's 10th race. Scratch number four, workplace six.